All right, so I get asked a lot what the best way to stream on TikTok is. Don't use stream elements, it's absolute trash. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is go over to atom.tv and go to the products here and download Atom Vertical. And then you're also gonna need uh, Atom Multistream. Run the uh, installer. Once we have Atom installed, you set up all your scenes. If you come over here to this website, it is Streamlabs TikTok Stream Key Generator. Streamlabs TikTok Live Access. You can request access here. Be sure to do this. See, mine says approved. Yours might say apply for access and hit the download. Click here and you want this one. Come down here into the Streamlabs TikTok Generator, yada, yada, yada. It's a really long name. I recommend right clicking this and create a shortcut to your desktop. You need a token here. You just hit load from web and it should open a browser window. So I just logged in uh, using the QR code. And so once you do, once you uh, get the token, it should be populated, the status should be approved, can go live, true. You can change the stream title and game category, enable mature content, and then all you have to do is click go live and boom. Stream started successfully. Copy the URL, go back to OBS, okay? Now we hit our settings, we add an output, TikTok, you put the server here, come back here, copy the key, paste it here, create an output. And unfortunately, every time you go live, you're gonna have to paste this key in here. This is handy to have because you don't have to have the TikTok Studio app open. You can just have this little app open, which uses up like zero resources, right? You don't have to mess with the OBS virtual camera. You don't have to do any of that stuff. It just is a direct stream right to TikTok. Now, when you end your stream, that's why you wanna leave this open. When you're ready to end the stream, because it's technically live right now, you just hit end live and it's been ended successfully. And then uh, uncheck here and then uncheck this button here. And that should be end your stream. If you don't do that, uh, OBS will start uh, glitching out if you do not end the stream through that little uh, stream key generator app. Uh, this TikTok generator is probably the most reliable, uh, simplest, easiest way to go live directly through OBS without having to do that whole rigmarole with the virtual camera. Um, and then you don't have to have the TikTok studio app open in the background, eating up all your resources. Hopefully this video helped you guys. Uh, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel uh, for more videos like this. Until then, we will see you in the next one. Peace.